Well, I think we should be the most balanced, the most stable, the most sane, the most reasonable and rational. And even beyond that, of course, we have a living hope. Uh, we know where we're headed. Eternity is settled for us. Far better to depart and be with Christ so that the worst that could ever happen to us would be the, the best that could ever happen. And I think this is a time for us to make manifest our, our faith. And uh, uh, yesterday um, was Sunday for us, and we, we weren't allowed to have anybody here, but I, I preached anyway in Matthew 6, where Jesus three times said, stop worrying. Why are you worrying about your life, your food, your drink? your clothing, um, your heavenly Father knows you have need of all these things. And, and the Psalms are just full of divine promises that God is our refuge and our strength. And so this is an opportunity for Christian people who, who say they trust in the Lord and they put their faith in Jesus Christ to demonstrate that by being stable and even hopeful and even joyful. The kingdom of, of God is joy in the Holy Spirit. And this is a great time for that. Uh, this isn't like the Black Death. I, I, I told our people, 75 million people died in the Black Death, and one writer said that they were, the bodies were stacked like lasagna. Some Italian writer said that. Uh, it was a horrific time. And of course, every year, 60 million people die around the world. Death is not new to us. So uh, we, we should be the people who have no fear. We should be without fear because our trust is in the Lord. And this is an opportunity for us to declare that if you have no hope and if you have fear, and all people do when it comes to controlling their life and particularly their death, this is a great time for us to be the living testimony of what true faith in, in the Lord looks like.